What if you could have workstation level hardware in a sleek stylish chassis? You'd hardly have to dream of it as it already exists. The Dell Precision 175770 takes the best of the Dell in terms of hardware and design, borrowing many elements from the flagship XPS series. Let's start with the unboxing. Inside the box we find a 130 watts USB Type-C charger. Then we have a USB Type-C to USB Type-A and HDMI dongle. There is also some paperwork, but we won't waste your time with that. For starters, the combination of aluminum and carbon fiber has both looks and durability. Also, there aren't a lot of manufacturers that do it as well as Dell. The laptop has a matte grey lid, bottom panel and sides. The base and lid bezels are all from carbon fiber, with the classic texture appearing above and below the keyboard. For a 17-inch notebook, we are surprised by the lack of a numpad. Instead, we see large speaker grills on the left and right sides. The keyboard generally has large keys with good key travel and clicky feedback. The pad has a large surface and lacks a glass cover, but it's still very smooth, while the accuracy and responsiveness make it one of the best. The laptop offers strength in numbers, with 4 Thunderbolt 4 ports. The rest of the I.O. is lacking, with no LAN port or any HDMI ports. What you get are an HD card reader and a 3.5mm audio jack. We splurged for a 4K UHD Plus panel, but there is also a Full HD Plus IPS display. The 4K display crushes it, especially at a 17-inch form factor. The angles are excellent, while a max brightness of 540 nits ensures a good working environment even in bright conditions or outside. The laptop shows full or near-full coverage of the sRGB, Adobe RGB and DCI-P3 gamuts. We achieved the best possible color accuracy results of a 1.6 Delta E value with the Dell Premier color sRGB profile and our design and gaming profile. The display uses PWM to adjust brightness below 140 nits, after which the pulsations have a low amplitude, which makes them safer. We see a very large 97 Wh unit, which gives us 14 hours and 43 minutes of web browsing or 9 hours and 44 minutes of video playback, when paired with the Core i7 12700H, the 4K panel and the RTX A2000. These are pretty good results for such a powerful 17 incher. Only 2 per 100 people watching this video are subscribers. If you decide to just start following us, we'll be able to reinvest more in our laboratory thus making even more helpful videos for you. Thank you, you're awesome! The device performs really well among its workstation competitors, mainly due to the large performance increase from Tiger Lake to Alder Lake. On the GPU end, the RTX A2000 scores pretty well, but it doesn't lead the performance charts. We always appreciate a large vapor chamber, especially when accompanied by two fans that keep the CPU and GPU cool. On the other hand, our stress test revealed that the Core i7 12700H drops its clock speed heavily in the later stages. The GPU maintains a clock speed of around 1600 MHz throughout the test. The outside temperature maxes out at 49 degrees Celsius, which is a bit high, while the fans are relatively quiet. The device is held together by torque screws, a total of 8 of them. You can get more insight into the teardown process with our disassembly video, which we have in the description below. Inside we have two RAM slots that fit DDR5 memory along with two SSD slots that run at Gen 4 speeds. As most workstation laptops go, this one is rather expensive, but we feel like it offers enough to put it ahead of the competition. The 12th Gen Intel processors are a blessing. 
while the 4K display and long battery life complement the performance even further. If you want to see more tests and details about the device, you can check out our in-depth review. The link is in the video description below.